update you now on some breaking news that we were first to tell you about at 430. Everyone inside of a Southeast Portland home made it out safely when it went up in flames this morning. Brent Weisberg is live at the scene where firefighters remain. Brent. Jenny, good morning to you. I just got an update from firefighters. They are telling us that the three people who are inside this home, they are all staying with friends, so they don't need the help from the American Red Cross. Behind me here, you can still see some of the Portland Fire and Rescue. There are fire trucks here. The firefighters right now are in the process of just cleaning up, gathering all their hose lines, putting them back on their fire trucks. But as you're getting ready this morning, take a look at your television screen. This is video you're only going to see on Coin 6 News this morning. This all happened around 4.07. This is what firefighters found when they got here. Neighbors tell me they could feel the heat coming from these flames. Firefighters say there are three people inside. They all got out safely. The cause of the fire is still under investigation. New this morning, I have been able to confirm that members of the Portland Police Bureau's Drugs and Vice Division have been told about this fire. That's because there was a marijuana grow found inside the home. At this point, police caution that just because DVD has been notified doesn't mean that anything illegal was happening. Firefighters tell me it took them about 20 or minutes or so to knock down all the flames. The arson investigator is here on scene. We should let you know that 92nd in Southeast Lincoln is now back open after earlier firefighters had to close it so they could stretch their hose lines. It is now open. The only thing that is blocked is this street right here. That is Southeast Lincoln between 92nd and 90th. Jenny, back to you. All right, Brent. Thank you for that update.